Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and today we are going to model a wooden box. This is a very simple and easy model. So let's start. First of all, we are going to take a box, press shift and right click and take a cube. Press T to open the manipulator and increase all these three parameters. I'm going to take four. Now we are going to unwrap it. So either you can go to panel and you can open saved layouts, perspective and UV editor, or you can just go to workspace and select UV editing. Now what you have to do is select your model, go to create and click automatic. Now we have a wooden texture here. We are going to impose this texture on our model. So now what we have to do is stitch these UVs. So select an edge, press shift right click and move into edges. And we have to do the same with the others. Now select the UV shell, press shift right click and go to layout, layout UV. Now select your model apply a material go to color file and import the texture press 6 to enable the texture in viewport Scale down the UVs according to your need and it looks okay for now or you can just select the UV and drag it upwards and drag those down just a little bit. Tweaks here and there, and it's done. Now we are going to render it. So, what I am going to do is go to Arnold. I'm going to use Arnold render. So, go to Arnold and select lights and select sky dome. It will cre create a dome around your model. So Go to attribute editor, go to color, and you can import a HDRI image. Now go to in the settings, resets. You can either use HD1080 or one square. I'm going to use HD1080. And I'm going to take the resolution to 300 and I'm going to use the optics denoiser now we open the Arnold render view and render it Now as you can see the, there is a the reflection on our model. So you select your model, stop the render, go to the material attribute and diffuse roughness to 0 0.3 and roughness to 
specular to zero and render it again and if you want to create some pump for details here what you can do is just go to geometry go to pump mapping file pump value and import the same texture you used as diffuse and pump depth value put it like 0.1 and render it you can see some details here and you can see some oily smudge like texture here so you can decrease the value of pump Thank you very much. That's all for today. We'll see you in the next video.